A third construction worker is killed on the job in the city in less than a week. As loved ones mourn their loss, city officials are calling for tighter safety regulations. New York One's Van Chu has that story. Loved ones are mourning the loss of 34-year-old Gregory Echevarria, who they lovingly called Mo. His niece says the father of four, an Army veteran, was originally from Puerto Rico and started work in the construction industry five years ago. He was a character. He was real funny. He was like a big bear. You know, he was a jokester. He was a good guy. Echevarria was killed Saturday morning on the job at 570 Broome Street, the construction site of a 25-story residential building in Soho just outside of the Holland Tunnel. City officials say workers were erecting a crane when a 6,500-pound counterweight fell on top of him. He was pronounced dead at the scene. A second worker was injured. It's not a job that you can take playing around. is a very serious job. But we're going to be an alert things happen. You know, unfortunately it happens. I'm sorry that it did. I really do miss him a lot. Echevarria's death is the third construction worker fatality in the city in a week. 51-year-old Nelson Salina was killed Monday by falling debris outside an apartment building on the east side. 23-year-old Eric Mendoza fell 13 stories to his death in Brooklyn Wednesday. Elected officials are sounding the alarm for tighter safety regulations after this deadly week. Council member Robert Carnegie, the chair of the city council's housing and buildings committee, said in a statement, it is also a reminder of the importance of implementing the construction site safety training mandates of local law 196 of 2017, which will be a vitally important way to prevent future fatalities like these. Family friends who also work in construction say the job is just inherently dangerous. There's never enough protection, not in that type of job. If something coming down 50 miles an hour down, listen, if it comes down fast, it's coming down. You know, the only thing you can do is run. Family members say Echevarria was attempting to save another worker when the counterweight fell. They say he died a hero. Meanwhile, investigators are working to figure out what went wrong. There is currently a stop work and a stop use order on both the construction site and the crane. Reporting in Soho, Van 2, New York 1. Police are